gonna try and get inside. If anyone's still out there, listen. If anyone's still alive. Sorry, I thought they got you. Come on, come on. Come on, check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus, I had no idea. We're putting this whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, we gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula. And then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these... They came around this way. Check inside the truck. Okay, shh. They're in there! Yeah. 
I'd be dead if it weren't for you. We gotta get back, but we gotta be smart. We don't know who we can trust. Fuck you, Oh no. Oh no. They got the roads blocked. Children, and together 
You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it. For years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation. Over, come here, deputy. We need to talk. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive. For now. Seems they've been split up. Each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it. I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. The problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Be careful out there. It's crawling with Peggy's. Those fucking... 
I knew Joseph Seed was bad business when he wormed his way in here a few years back. I imagine the fucking mainstream media would paint us as two sides of the same coin, because they're either lazy or corrupt or both. But to me, it's simple. I'm willing to sacrifice everything for my family, while Joseph Seed wants to burn down the world for his. Sooner. These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. That was too close. Thanks. I can't thank you enough. Air traffic. That smoke plume is pretty thick, but 
I need a closer look. What I can't figure out is what all these Peggy's are doing out here. There's a whole bunch of them in the woods, calling out like they're looking for someone. I, I don't know if they're involved, but they seem pretty crusty and... Holy hell! A pickup just drove by like nobody's business, and the Peggy's in the back row carrying rifles and shotguns. Got back in the garage.
down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. Thanks. 